John chapter 14, almost done here. John chapter 14, verse 8. Philip saith unto him, Lord, show us the Father, and it sufficeth us. Jesus saith unto him, have I been so long time with you, and yet have you not known me, Philip? I mean, think about it. He wasn't being nice. Yeah, I mean, we read this in King James. See, so you read King James, and King James can make anything sound nice, right? Behold, I shall strike thee in thy head and killest thee. <laughs> oh, that's so pretty. That's so pretty. No, he's talking about smashing somebody's head, right? But King James makes it all nice. And here we read this with Jesus. Have you not known me, Philip? Have I been so long time with you? That isn't how he said it. Because you know he got on to them several times because they didn't have faith. He said, where's your faith? He said, you perverse generation. How long do I have to put up with you? That's what he told them. He's asleep in the boat. Been preaching three days, basically. And is in the back of a boat, finally. Getting some sleep after all the press and all the people constantly coming. And all of a sudden a storm comes up and now he's rocking back there. And it's good. He's asleep. And his disciples... Walk back. Now, can you imagine being in a, I'm not going to say a dead sleep because that wouldn't fit Jesus, but <laughs> can you imagine being in a deep sleep and you're back there just probably dreaming heaven, angels, things he's seen. Can you imagine what dreams Jesus would have had? Never thought about that before. That's something. Anyway, <laughs> anyway okay. But can you imagine what that would be like? And he's back there in the middle of a Jesus dream, which you know is going to be amazing. You know Jesus didn't have nightmares. You know, for Jesus, you know, some people have nightmares, the devil's chasing them, and they're running. With Jesus, it'd be the opposite. And it wouldn't be a nightmare. It'd be a fun dream. I get to chase devils, even in my dream. That's probably the kind of stuff he would dream about, ain't it? I don't know. And neither do you, so you can't say either way. So anyway, okay? But, but you have to realize what he did, Right? And he's back there asleep. And then, I mean, come on, he's in a complete deep sleep. And his disciples walk back there and go, Jesus! What? Don't you care? We're going to die out here. We're dying and you're back there sleeping. And he gets up and they're like, okay, now Jesus is going to do something. And he walks up there and says, peace be still. Where's your faith? Why didn't you do it? You just saw all this stuff happened, you should have said this. You should have got up and... I didn't say get to the middle of the lake and drown. I said, let us go to the other side. So anything that popped up, you should have dealt with. Now, deal with it. You think you can handle a calm sea? Will I go back to sleep? <laughs> it doesn't say he preached to him the rest of the night. So he probably went back and went back to sleep. And they all sat there, probably just sat there. No, if it's calm, no wind. Probably just sitting there in the middle of the lake thinking about how Jesus just jumped on him. Yeah. Wow. You know, he, he ain't what everybody thinks he is. <laughs> He's all, oh, let the little children come to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, yeah, we'll just try not walking in faith and see how he treats you. Just saying, right? Because he changes not. <laughs> Amen. Have you ever had Jesus say, where's your faith in the middle of something? I have. Something I'm looking at this and I'm like, oh, and then you get the idea. Well, we could make it work that we could do. We could. And he's like, where's your faith? I didn't tell you to do this. I said, I'll do it. All you got to do is believe. And I'm like, okay, I'm trying to believe. You don't try to believe, right? And I'm like, okay, I'm believing, I'm believing, I'm believing, I'm believing, I'm believing, I'm believing, I'm believing. And then you hear Jesus. Believing is not nervous. There's no nervous in arrest. Faith is arrest. Believing and believing. Okay. Maybe he won't see my... Yeah. No, he wants you to have faith. Amen?